Is this Brown Town? Are we at Brown Town? Well, I did catch that brown trout. If this isn't Brown Town, I want you to take me to Brown Town. Hey, I'm Ben. I'm a huge fly fisherman. Hey, welcome back to another episode of Huge Fly Fisherman. Today's another one of those watch Ben go fishing videos. You keep asking for them, so I'll keep bringing them. And I know a lot of people are stuck at home right now. You're hungry for content. I'm bringing it to you. I'm fortunate enough I can get out to fish, so I'm gonna bring you along today. I have with me my friend Adam. Hey guys. That's him. Adam's a full-time fly fishing guide. I get a lot of requests to guide and I don't really guide anymore and Adam is pretty much where I send everybody. Today we're going to be fishing a piece of river that is actually private. Adam has access to it and he's just hooked a fish. So if you want to fish here, you can call Adam or if you just want to fish with Adam at all, I'm going to leave his info in the video description. Give him a shout. You won't regret it. Look a fish. Oh, beautiful. So we're just getting started, kind of messing around. Adam broke the ice with that fish and I'm gonna start fishing. I've got my nymph set up that I was using last time you guys saw me fish. Just an egg and a worm today. And I'm also gonna throw a wooly bugger a little bit. So, all right, let's go, I guess. Oh, we got some beer too. Okay, here we go. Nymphing. Oh man, it looked so fishy. I posted that video last week of us going fishing and somebody made a comment that was like, you should talk more about the flies you were using. Well, it's an egg fly, and today it's an egg fly and a worm fly. So I don't think it really needs much more explanation than that. Not real complicated. That is not a fish. This water's pretty cold. And there's the wind. Oh, no. All right, let's go for the meat. I'm dirtying up the water. I could do without that. Not game fish. What is that? It feels like a stick. I suck. All right, now what? Let's try this dang old wooly bugger over here. Strip. Not very deep. There's a dead one. There's a brown trout. All right, back to the nymph. Yeah, water's still kind of cold. I bet the fishing will get better later on in the day. It's like 10.30 probably right now. Here I go. That is a very un undercut bank over there. Looks like it anyway. I guess I just suck. That's deep. All right, show me how to do it. I'm gonna have a beer. That's the fish call. The fish heard me open that beer. Now they're gonna, they're gonna be biting everything. I think these fish are cold. Yeah, and a lot of times, like this time of year, the fish is not super hot and they're kind of end up consolidated still in the, like where they were over winter. Yeah. The bottom of that pool. Yeah, like the slow, deep stuff yeah. in the back. They're winter haunts. Wonder if I'm gonna catch a fish today. Say, so just piece of water, you gonna fish off frame? There you go. <laughs> I catched one. Well, I hooked one. <laughs> <laughs> Will you net this fish for me? Show the viewers your guide skills. Decent fish. Looks like a brown trout. All right. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Stop. Just stop. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is great for you. I have to cut it all apart. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a surgical patient here. The hazards of fishing droppers. This dude is so wrapped up in it. I don't have any choice but to cut it and retie it. Good thing I got a beer so I can have something to do while I'm retying. Oh my goodness. All right, give him a drink. Thank you. All right, I'm, I'm gonna be down for a little while here. <laughs> oh man. Is this Brown Town? Are we at Brown Town? Well, I did catch that brown trout. If this isn't Brown Town, I want you to take me to Brown Town. Butter ditch. Fish are heating up. Right during the mend, of course. Negative. Uh. I don't like these center punch holes. I like it better when it's on one side. Yeah. yeah, you just get these massive dead spots. All right, next one. All right, let me check in with you. Fishing is slow. I think we've each caught one fish. Adam's fishing more sensible flies than I am. He's fishing like beta sea nymphy type stuff. I've still got the junk on. I think the water's still got to warm up. We saw a rise, so we switched to dries. No, I'm just kidding. All right, we're gonna keep going. Oh, man. There, oh, that was a fish. I just missed one. Oh, that was another fish. Just once, I'd like a nice day without any wind, man. All right. Adam just hooked a fish and lost his reel. Oh, I'm getting the fish. Nice, oh, nice fish. 
Okay, I was messing around with my batteries and stuff and Adam caught that fish. So maybe things are looking up. What you got? It's a trout. It's a game fish. I'm gonna net it. Oh gosh, I'm sabotaging. I stepped on his line. <laughs> I tried my best to sabotage there. Okay, little fish. We'll make quick work of releasing him. See ya. Thank you. Good job! Adam's using a little red and black Frenchy thing. Probably can't see it. Oh, he's on! He's on. Little one. Am I netting this fish or are you? You, you can do that yourself? It's a trout. <laughs> All right, there's a little side channel here. I'm gonna throw the woolly booger through there. See, I'm carrying two rods today. I don't normally do that. Normally I think it's stupid, but I'm stupid today. Also, because I'm fishing a streamer upstream, which is also stupid. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm streaming. There's no fish in here. Did you say you saw There's one? one. Yeah, I, oh, I guess there was a fish in there. I never saw it. You're a liar. That's an old guide trick, right? Oh, yeah, there goes one. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was totally there. Lost my worm. Just keep going. That's a fish. Maybe snagged. Nope. In the mouth. I did it. Not real big. Bye. Thank you. I'm still up. Adam just had two fish on his double nymph rig. Now he has one little fish, which is pretty typical in that scenario. The big fish gets off. <laughs> All right, he's retying. I'm gonna go through this, throw this woolly bugger. If you're wondering what the yellow stuff is on my rod, those are tape markings. Because I have two rods that are the same. One's a four weight, one's a five weight. And I keep them in a big tube with a whole bunch of rods all jumbled up together. So that's so I can tell them apart. Also, it looks awesome. Racing stripes. I think these fish are gonna be farther back in the hole. Slow, slow, slow. Yeah, how about a little streamer fishing tip? Rod tip down, in the water, right at the water surface, all the time. Straight line from your hand to that fly. Just so you can feel the bite. This is bad. This is good. They don't want it. Let's catch them! How come you haven't caught one? I'm gonna woolly bugger this. Not even a f nibble. Just give me a little nibble. Just a little nibble. Little nibble. Little nibble. Little, I should articulate it. Stupid non-articulated fly. It's worthless. Inarticulate. <laughs> Today I've got one reel that's right-handed and one that's left-handed. <laughs> I just keep going to the wrong side. You gonna nymph that? Right now. And now. And now. Does that help when I when I say that? Weird hole. Looks like it holds fish though. That's a deep hole. I might not even... Oh, I am deep enough, I guess. Uh, what, what has happened? Oh my goodness. What did I hit? Was that you? My oh my god. All right. You, you go. It's gonna take me a while. <laughs> I don't even... This is a unique one. All right, so this is where I teach you how to untangle knots. <laughs> Start from the fly end. Work from the fly end back. I don't think I need to cut anything here. Look at that, James. Still fishing your fly. Oh, look. It just oh, casually got a fish. It appears to be a game fish, a brown trout. Did you catch it on a fly rod? Fly pole. Whoa, that's awesome. dude, that's not a good place to fall in. <laughs> so yeah, you can flip him over, don't be shy. <laughs> okay, my turn. It is windy and cold. I'm just fishing an egg fly now, just one fly. I should probably change it, but I'm way too lazy. Adam's flies seem to be doing much better than mine. Maybe that's just because he's a better fisherman. It's a nice hole. That's a fish. A little one. I did it, guys. I did it. I knew I could do it. Little rainbow. He's pretty. It's a nice, perfect fish. Your turn. Yeah, man. Yeah. There we go. Nice. Nice. Probably the best fish I've hooked all day. I would like to touch it. I want to touch this one. This is my PAP sponsorship fish. Nice, all right, all right. Cool. Yay! Oh, one fly. This egg, this individual fly, has caught so many fish this spring, it should be retired. And there's another one. That is a trout. Oh, and it's gone. Barbless hook came right out. So oh. Adam's flies have been doing better than mine today, but I caught two fish, or I caught a fish out of this hole and then he fished it a bunch, caught nothing, and then I made one cast and hooked a fish. That's why I'm huge. Let's get another one. 
Oh, he's on, he's on, he's on. Oh, it jumped. I believe it's a game fish. I caught one, another one after you left, just so you know. Bruh. Oh, he's got another one. He's got another one. Probably another game fish. I think it's the same fish. Okay, next spot. Looks good. Looks real good. Right in the seam is where I want to be. Here, come fish this. I haven't got a bite. And I have a hard time believing there's not a fish in there. I didn't have the camera on. It's a good fish. What's that bright orange thing in his face? I'm gonna have to back way up here for you. It's a trout. Nice, dude. Nice. Hell yeah. All right. Hey, look at that adipose. Yeah. I think, think it's still November. <laughs> oh, it's, it's beautiful. Wow. Yeah. Here, will you hold that, yeah. please? Thank you. Oh, beautiful fish. Right. Oh yeah, man. Oh, you you got those blue cheeks. I think we found Brown Town. <laughs> That's a beautiful fish. We'll keep him in the water. Calm down. Oh, he just broke me off. But you know what? That is my ultra special fly. And I'm about to get it back gently. This fly, man, has done a lot of stuff in the last couple months. Oh, he's a bit skinny and soft. It's been a long winter for that guy. He is skinny and soft, huh? Yeah, he's handsome, but he needs a break. See ya. Go eat. All right, your turn. Upon inspection, this fly is falling apart. I think it has just died its death with that last fish, which is fine. I got another one. Thanks, James. Do you want to nymph this? You should. I keep forgetting to turn my camera on because I'm busy just having a good time. But I hooked another fish. Oh, is he in the butt? Oh, wouldn't be a proper fishing day without in the butt. No, nope, no. Nope. Unfortunately, it's in the mouth. Come on. Ow, I just hooked myself. Bye. I caught one! All right, let's go to the next hole. Man, I need to keep this camera on. Adam just had a spectacular delayed hook set. Calling you out. Oh, it's a good fish, too. Let me get the net. Ooh, let me display my guide skills. Oh, nice, dude. Nice, nice, nice. It appears to be a male a brown trout. He really wants to get under that bank. Did he come out from that bank? Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Look at that. Oh. No, he's not skinny. He's like a little stubby, even. Oh, that's nice, dude. Snap, snap. All right, see you, buddy. Thank you. Uh, yeah, finally. Oh, it jumped. Oh, it jumped again. Oh, oh, it's a, it's angry. It's angry. Let's keep him up here. He's he wants to go down. That was a such a narrow lane. I did not get a good drift, and then finally on that one, I was like, yeah. that's a good drift. Yeah. Finally, the fly and the bob. It got the in the lane. same yeah. lane. Yes, it was dramatically different, and it resulted in a. Rainbow trout. Ow. Ow, why? Why, 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 why? Hey, hang on, hang on. You're a nice rainbow trout. Oh, now we're in Rainbow Town. Thank you. Okay, your turn. Okay, that's it. That's the end of the line. That's the end of this episode of Huge Fly Fisherman. Today was pre-runoff fishing. It started off kind of slow, but we caught plenty of fish by the end of the day. It warmed up a little. Thanks, Adam, for getting me out here today. It was super fun. I'll leave Adam's details in the video description so you can book a trip with him. This is a good place to fish. I post a new Huge Fly Fisherman video every Monday. Check out hugeflyfisherman.com. Drop a like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Stay huge. Don't forget to mend your line and set your damn hook.